This video provides instructions on how to use Maxa therapy when your baby is in breech position. Maxa therapy involves warming certain areas of the body with a glowing Maxa stick. The most essential area being an acupuncture point in the little toe. Depending on the stage of your pregnancy, warming this acupuncture point will increase the chances of your baby turning considerably. You will learn how to perform this treatment in the correct way yourself. The results of this treatment are explained on our website. The instructions are divided into four separate videos. The first part will show you the exact technique of the treatment, which is the warming of acupuncture point bladder 67 in a safe and effective way by using the Maxa stick. In part two, we will explain how to use the Maxa stick safely. In addition, you will be taught how to light and put out the stick. The third video will show you how to perform a home treatment, while the final video will teach you how to perform the treatment on yourself without help from someone else. Part 1 This part will show you what the treatment involves. Using the glowing Maxa stick, you warm the acupuncture point on the left and right little toe for 15 minutes each. Try to fit the treatment into your schedule at around the same time every day. Heat the skin of the little toe with the Maxa stick. Check the glowing of the stick by softly blowing at the end of the stick and shake off the ashes. Don't shake off the ashes too gently. You will only have shaken off enough once you see the end glowing again. The acupuncture point we are going to heat is on the side of the little toe just next to its nail. This point is marked with a dot. The best way to heat this point is by holding the right foot with the right hand and the left foot with the left hand. Put your index finger on the nail of the little toe and your thumb on the bottom of the little toe. Make sure that the end of the index finger and thumb are positioned on the side of the little toe. Move the Maxa stick slowly up and down from the index finger to the thumb. The part of the skin on the little toe where the bladder 67 acupuncture point is located will be warmed simultaneously. Make sure you hold the Maxa stick at least one centimeter or one third of an inch away from the skin. The stick should never touch the skin. Within seconds you will experience warmth at the index finger as well as the thumb and so will your partner on her little toe. Beware you should feel the warmth yet it shouldn't become unpleasant. During the 15 minutes the warmth should be felt as much as possible. Experience shows that during the treatment, the baby becomes increasingly lively. Don't let this scare you off, as it is quite normal. To ensure a safe treatment, it is essential to communicate well. If the warmth gets too much, you will have to slightly add to the distance to the little toe. Take the left foot with the left hand and repeat the treatment. This toe should also be worn for 50 minutes. Please remember to put out the Maxa stick after the treatment, as shown in part 2. Part 2 In this part we will teach you how to use the Maxa stick. This special type of Maxa stick has been produced for use in the home situation. A packing contains five Maxa sticks and can be ordered through this website. Only if the instructions are properly applied, these five sticks will be sufficient for a two-week treatment period and you will save 60% of your money. Remove the wrapping from the stick. As it will take a little while before the Maxa stick is glowing, you will need a candle to light it. Hold the end of the Maxa stick in a flame and take your time to let it glow. Turn the stick regularly to ensure a regular glow all around the end of the stick. During use, shake off the ashes at the end of the Maxa stick regularly. Be careful as the ashes are hot, so ensure you have an ashtray or heat-proof container ready. 
check whether the stick is still glowing by softly blowing on the end of the stick. Now the stick is ready for use. There are two ways to extinguish the Moxa stick in a way you will be able to use it again the next day. The first one is to put the stick into a glass jar and screw the lid on. The lack of oxygen will put out the stick. The second one is to place the stick in a previously prepared bowl of kitchen foil with a shaped hole. Make the bowl of kitchen foil before lighting the Moxa stick. Part 3 It is important to do the treatment in a comfortable and safe way. You are going to use a glowing very hot Moxa stick. Be careful as the ashes are hot as well. The most common position is lying down on a couch. Just lie down and place your feet on the armrest. You don't have to sit up straight, just make yourself comfortable and relax. Now perform the treatment as instructed in the first video. Warm the acupuncture point, which is located on the little toe, for 50 minutes. Don't forget to have an ashtray or heat-proof container ready to put in the ashes. After the treatment, put out the Moxa stick as shown in part 2. Part 4 In the previous videos you saw how the treatment must be followed in order to get an optimal result. It may be that there is no one to provide the treatment for you. That's why we will show you how you can perform it on yourself. You will need two pieces of kitchen foil, a book of about one third of an inch thick covered in foil, and a washcloth or flannel filled with rice. To protect the floor, first cover it with a piece of kitchen foil. Light the Moxa stick as shown in part 2 and just place one end of the stick on the book and fix it with the rice-filled washcloth. Now gently move your foot towards the glowing end of the stick. Always keep a gap between the stick and the skin of your little toe. The warmth should be clearly felt, but never be painful. Switch to the other little toe after 15 minutes. We wish you good luck and hope the treatment will be successful.